Hey all and welcome to this video all about what are the cornerstones of learning engagement. Here at Growth Engineering, learning engagement is something we talk about a lot and for a very good reason. So let's start off with what is learner engagement. By engagement, we refer to the level of involvement, enthusiasm, attention and interest that learners have towards the learning process and the content that they are being taught. We believe that the more engaged your learners are, the more likely they are to learn, to understand, to be curious, and to apply the information. Similarly, it's impossible to drive behavior change or impact business outcomes if your audience doesn't really care or is not engaged. So as such, and to put very simply, <laughs> learner engagement is the secret source for any learning initiative. So this video is all about what are the cornerstones of getting that learner engagement. Short-term learner engagement is relatively easy to achieve. However, if you want to deliver a return on investment with your learning and development budget, learners have to engage with your learning programs ongoing throughout their career within your organization. In fact, the goal is to have mentally present, emotionally connected, socially connected, proactive, curious learner base that have a hunger for continuous learning within your organization. And it's this type of learner engagement that requires a strategy. So first of all, you need to set engagement goals. And these goals need to be in line with your learning development objectives. You then need to identify what kind of approaches work best for engaging your learners within your organization. After all, each organization has a unique audience. Now here at Growth Engineering, we are big fans of using gamification, social learning, epic meaning, all to drive engagement. Okay, so let's look at these three things individually. Gamification, social, epic meaning. Gamification utilizes the fun of games by bringing game mechanics like XP, badges, leaderboards, into the learning environment. When learners enjoy training, they feel engaged and they want to keep learning. Social learning is another great way to increase learner engagement. After all, humans are social animals and have engaged in social learning for as long as people have been around. And finally, epic meaning. Epic meaning is all about creating a sense of purpose. And one way to do this is to clearly communicate how the learning objective is connected to your company's wider mission and values. Similarly, make sure your training platform and content highlight this purpose by working together synergistically content and platform to further impact the epic meaning. One really good way of doing this is to make sure that your learning is in bite-sized chunks. No learner is gonna stay engaged if you give them page after page of text-heavy training content. Instead, try and use a variety of different content types and break your content up into bite-sized chunks with micro-learning. Every learner has unique needs and preferences and acknowledging these unique needs and preferences will help you guide your strategy and increase the level of engagement you're getting in your audience. Last but not least, remember to listen to learner feedback. Seeking actionable user feedback is a great way to show that you listen and you care about the learning that you're delivering. So in summary, there we have it. Engaging learners isn't necessarily easy, but there are tools that you can use to create really great results. If you can match your learner needs to an effective gamification strategy, an effective social learning strategy, and really create a sense of epic meaning in your overall L&D strategy, 
you are really likely to make a fantastic impact. Good luck and have some fun.